Oh, excuse me? I think you check with her. Oh, thank you. No, of course. That hurts some. Did you see the last people that were at this table? Uh, no. Why? What's going on? It says on the receipt they only left me an eight cent tip, but there's five hundred dollars in here. <laughs> so I mean, maybe they really like the service. Or your computer could be broken. I mean, I don't know. That that looks like five. That doesn't look like eight cents to me. Our computer works very well, and these customers are regulars. They don't leave me such a big tip. They can't afford this. I mean, well, it looks like they did. I mean, you said they left you eight cents. Yes, it says that on the receipt. So this is not mine. I mean, it it was in your checkbook though. Why don't you just keep it? I would love to keep this since I really do need groceries right now. I live in my dorms, but I cannot keep this. <laughs> what do you mean groceries? You can't afford groceries? I can't afford it right now. What's going on? Um, my brother, he's in a hospital right now. He's sick, and I've been giving half of my check to that. You've been, like, giving half of your check for your brother's, like, hospital bills? Yes. I mean... Why would you do that over, like, your own food, your own groceries? I love my family too much, so... But I mean, I'm just going to go give it to my manager and tell him what's going on. I mean, well, before you go to the, your manager... Um, here, take this. This is the money that I took out. Why um, would you do that? I swapped this money right here with the $500... Because I wanted to see if you were going to be an honest barista. A lot of people that work in this like service industry and work for tips, a lot of people would have just taken it and lied about it. But the fact that you were going to tell the truth, that shows that you're a good person, and I hope that helps out. Really? Are you sure? I'm positive. You deserve that and so many more blessings that are coming your way. God bless you, and I'm going to be praying for your brother. Thank you.